The rainforest is the most diverse terrestrial ecosystem on Earth. Diversity of the forest is very important because all the organisms can adapt to different climatic change, for example. And if we just have a few species, that wouldn't work. But all the species, they can adapt. So it's a kind of resilience which biodiversity gives us. Like everything in life, we don't know what we don't measure. So to be able to properly manage biodiversity, we need to be able to account for it. And up to now, it has always been a very manual, time-consuming process. And here technology plays a role because we can make the process of measuring biodiversity much more efficient. Technology gives us the power to see the world differently. It provides a shared visual language that is accessible, intuitive and insightful. Digital worlds give us the understanding needed to make the right decisions. They enable industries to visualize their data and put it to use to achieve sustainable outcomes in their operations. A digital twin is the digital representation of a physical object, of a component, could be small or big, or even the entire world. Hexagon makes precision sensors, robotics and software, all enabled with AI that create and activate digital twins across more than 27 industries. We provide the most advanced portfolio of spatial intelligence technologies in the world. We can capture everything from the smallest object to the entire planet. Now this technology is being used in the rainforest to quantify the true impact of humanity's actions. I'm working here since 1993. We started the Biological Corridor in 2006, which is the most important project at the moment and the University of Vienna. The Green Cubes initiative is a very new idea to protect old forests. Old forests are very important for the planet, for the ecosystem, for the biodiversity. And everybody's talking about carbon dioxide, but just for the new forests. And the old forests are forgotten forests, which is a really big problem at the moment. And Green Cubes is this new initiative to protect them. Hexagon used the LiDAR systems and also the ground sensors. And together with this uh, two remote sensing, we can make pictures, put together all this data and are forming a green cube with all the information which is inside the forest. The technology of Hexagon can help to find out in a quicker way how forests are, if they are in a good condition, in a bad condition. Otherwise, we have to go inside the forest to measure every tree to see what happened. It can can uh, be a big, big help to find out the state of the forest. We partnered with the University of Vienna because we believe co-creation in partnerships is very important to be able to accelerate the change towards more sustainable outputs. We started the university from moving into sensing a couple of trees to being able to map in different levels of complexity a full rainforest. This collaboration ensures that both sides of the table brings their core competences. We believe that investing in rainforest conservations can benefit from the years of practice that we have in sensors and reality capture systems. And we're convinced that the data insights that we are able to generate can support the scientists and the local communities to drive better impacts in these ecosystems. From the Gamba Tropen Station, we are able to get their scientific and their practical appearance so that we can teach our sensors how is it that what they see on the ground translate to the biodiversity level of the ecosystem. With this new technology, we get a very high resolution of the forest and also on the ground, inside the forest and also inside the soil. And that together is a completely new field. Creating a digital twin of the rainforest involves a multitude of technologies in the hexagon portfolio, which are reality capture technologies. Macro picture we um, take from the air using airborne sensors, which are uh, huge cameras together with scanners that shoot laser dots to the ground, then sense the reflecting light. And you combine this data with data you do with mobile hand scanners. You go around the trees, and have a very accurate picture on the ground. And together you merge these two views to get the best representation of your digital twin of the rainforest. These tools transform data into intuitive visual experiences. 
They make complexity understandable, no matter our technical skill level. As advancements in AI technology continue, the next big step is to bring AI and digital twins together. This is spatial intelligence. Like how our brain learns and adapts over time, AI can do the same for digital twins. We can see problems early and fix them. We can predict things better and run complex simulations. And when we apply advancements in robotics, we can make faster progress in our journey towards sustainability. Hexagon has proven that it can drive efficiency in all the industries that it serves. It has been reducing the amount of materials that the industry needs, reducing the amount of utilities being fuel or power, it has been phasing out waste in these industries or even increasing the circularity of the business. I'm optimistic about the future. Projects like our Green Cubes initiative in Costa Rica and the work being done by the broader community of customers and partners show that the world is really serious about sustainability. And I strongly believe that these hexagon technology can unlock the potential of industry to solve the climate change.